This guy's getting dumped. This guy's getting dumped bigger time. Get him. Get him. Oh my god. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Mola's just like jumped on a land like twice now. Alright, I think he got him. There we go. Oh no! What are you? Oh, no, uh, not yet. Just, oh, there we go. There was something. <laughs> the big old snook, I think, right there. Nice Yeah. That was really big. Oh, no worries, man. Have a good night. Oh, there's a tarpon. There's a tarpon. <laughs> there you go. Real, 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 real. No? Yeah, you're on him. You're on him. You're on him. Oh, no, he just followed it up. Did you see that? Yeah. Got him. Got something. I don't know if it's a tarpon or a big... Oh, it's a tarpon. And there he goes. <laughs> you lost him? Yeah. You just put on a good little show. You did. Got two little shows out of him. So as you can see from the videos, it's been a really action-packed week so far up until this point. It's also been a really off week because I haven't hooked into any of these fish. Luckily, we went out, reloaded the next day with pinfish and some croakers. We found some finger mullet, some like candy-sized finger mullet getting popped up on. I mean, these things looked like you took like a five gallon bucket full of them and just threw them straight out of the water. So we knew some predator fish were nearby. We threw out and this is what happened. Check it out. I don't know if I'm flashing way under there. Those are mullet, those are finger mullet, but see there's stuff all around eating the crap out of the ones on the edges. Just let them run, let them run. It might be a jack. Oh, it's a nice red. That's a really nice red fish. Just let them fight. Actually, I would actually I would ignore what I'm saying. Get them in here as quick as possible because this dolphin's right on you. You're about to get dolphined instead of shark. <laughs> oh, wow. That's gorgeous. That's beautiful. Oh my gosh, where was that the other day? The manatee right behind us too, we got one of everything. It's about 27 inches. Alright. That was, oh crap, I'm on too. Oh my gosh. Doubled up. This is insane. Watch this be another big red. Yeah. That's what it is. Yeah. Oh my god. Now we can get a dual photo. Yeah. Put them in the live well. Eh, whatever. And the electrical. Where are your purse is. Heck yeah. I don't know if it's bigger. I think they're twins. This one's just fighting. It's a little bit bigger. <laughs> yeah, mine's 31. 
Remember, grab the tail, support the belly. There you go, perfect. You ready? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Smiling? Yeah. Right, we need to get them close to shore so they're safe. We're just gonna go straight into the bushes. Hold it by the fork of the tail with our, your right hand. Yeah. Uh, mine went the wrong way. Go ahead. Fork in. Don't worry about the boat. The boat's fine. Just make sure he kicks off. Side to side. Side to side. Yeah. All right. I think they're fine. We'll hang out here for a second. Those are big. Big and slimy. Our heart's racing just because I had to like, we had to get them out at the same time. Did I call it or did I call it, babe? I'm not bad at this when I find them. <laughs> so as you can see throughout that entire fight, there was definitely a lot of dolphin action going on in the background. That's why I got on that trolling motor and made sure I basically crashed the boat into the mangroves. We got a good strong release on both fish. Mine was an idiot, went under the boat, but I hung around for a while afterwards to make sure that the dolphin didn't come in and crash on them. Because if they do take your fish, they'll usually come right up to the boat, throw a huge head wake, and they basically do like their own little celebration. Uh, that didn't happen. I've also noticed that dolphin don't really seem to go after fish that are over 25 inches, in my experience, especially the redfish. The trout they seem to go after no matter what. But both appear to get away safely, which is awesome. That was the main mission. All right, so if you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like, drop me a comment. If you hated this video, drop me a dislike, drop me a comment, um, subscribe. Stay tuned, I'm trying to get back into one video a week, whether that's on the boat. Maybe we're gonna start trying some beach fishing before. I haven't done that yet, and I know the beach has been going off. So I might try some surf fishing. I got a fly rod I've been practicing. So a lot of different videos hopefully coming your way. Subscribe, stay tuned, peace.